A medium iced cinnamon dolce latte, please. I see a thumbnail opportunity, so I'm gonna take it. I got the Starbucks. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, that's so good. They had half off drinks today, so you know I had to go. I don't know why I was craving a cinnamon dolce latte, but here we go. Hey guys, it's Rachel. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm just going to go ahead and intro this video. I am going to be doing just a casual vlog. My life is kind of switching up this week because I have never taken a summer class in my life, but it started today and I just thought, you know what, I'm going to vlog for you guys. I feel like a lot of people like vlog like, you know, the main semesters, but I'm going to show you, you know, what I'm doing for my summer class. I'm just taking one. I'm doing it because it wasn't available last semester it's okay it's just one class and yeah I'm really honestly excited but I thought I would just go ahead and vlog this week for you guys and show you kind of what I do in a week like what my week looks like now that I'm doing like a summer class and yeah I'm super excited it's important to have a balance between school time and you know social time or doing things that you love and yeah it's it even if it's just going to get a cup of coffee after work it's just something little for yourself and so yeah that's what I just did but now I am going to go home and start on assignments and you guys are gonna come with me and I promise this is not just going to be a school vlog it's gonna be a fun vlog too. So anyways guys, let's go back to my house. <laughs> All right you guys, so I am home now and I am going to go ahead and I am going to relax, enjoy my coffee, and I wanna watch Colleen's new video because she's pregnant and I'm so excited for her. Oh my gosh, so I definitely wanna watch that real quick. And then I am going to jump into my schoolwork and yeah, I think what I'm going to do and make it my mission to have, okay, so my class is a six week class, which means it's going to go by very fast. There's 12 modules, so they're going to be doing two modules a week, which means I have like six discussion boards and essays and everything due a week, um, and then two quizzes a week and reading and all that so I'm going to try and have everything done by Tuesday night so I can have the rest of the week to myself you know so that is my little agenda in my head and yeah um, with that being said I'm going to relax a little bit and then I am going to get started all right you guys so this is my little online school setup obviously I'm not logged in but I am editing a video for you guys, but I'm going to have to minimize that for now. Um, yeah, I do have my Squishmallow just sitting here. But I want you guys to take a nice little look at this. This is all the stuff for one class. If I had taken this with my spring semester, I would have screamed for a real one. But anyways, um, I did a couple this morning because I didn't want to overwhelm myself. I wanted to familiarize myself. I went ahead and did it, but I do have um, an essay to write. It's like a reflection essay, and then I have to take a quiz, and then I have to do all this tomorrow, which is the module two section. And so, yeah, um, we're having a delightful time, but I do have to, uh, this is a delightful time, but you know what? It's okay. Honestly, this class is exciting to me, so I really don't mind. But on Thursday, May 20th, I wrote Bobby because we're hanging out after I get off work so you know what that's something to look forward to and uh, I'm gonna sit here eat some squashies um, this will probably already be out by the time that this vlog is out it definitely will be I tried British candy and um, yeah it's almost gone but uh, yeah that's that's the situation right now Fletcher is the cutest squishmallow in my opinion bye Okay, so I just wanted to say I am really excited for Colleen. Like, I'm just sitting here waiting for my computer to do its thing because for some reason my Wi-Fi just disconnected. But I just, I keep thinking about it and um, she, I just, I love her. There's definitely a tear in my eye right now. I just, I love Colleen and I'm really excited for her. Um... That's all I had to say in this clip, but I just, you know, I'm sitting here waiting for my Wi-Fi to reconfigure itself and figure it out. So, I just wanted to say that. It's Olivia.
Olivia Rodrigo always understanding the assignment for me. She literally does not miss. This girl is so talented. I am so excited to hear Sour on Friday. Her debut album comes out on Friday and it's called Sour. And I love Driver's License, I love Deja Vu, and I love Good For You. Like, again, this girl does not miss. I'm so excited, but I'm gonna go in Walgreens real quick and see if they have any Squishmallows. Um, and then I'm gonna probably go get something to eat. Guys, guys. I I literally literally just took a chance first of all even walking in there and then I was like oh they don't have them and then I was like let me check like the toy section and they were randomly sitting there I'm I literally was not yeah that's my um sweater in the back sorry but um I literally, I, I gasped so loud and I wasn't filming like me walking there because I was like, they're not going to have them in the section. I saw Rutabaga and let me just tell you, I lost my mind. Okay. Like I have been looking for Rutabaga. <laughs> I'm so excited right now. Oh my God. Not me finding Rutabaga. I think this is one of the cutest ones. I cannot believe I just found Rutabaga. Like, you have no idea how in shock I am right now. It is the next morning, and I stopped at Krispy Kreme because they have a new key lime pie donut. Oh my god. It's so good. Hello you guys. So it is now Wednesday night and I have not vlogged all day. But now I am at the point where I'm just relaxing. I came home. I took a quiz. I had some Chick-fil-A for dinner if anybody was wondering. And now I'm FaceTiming Emma. Hello you guys, so it is now Thursday and it is the afternoon and you guys want to hear my realization of the week? I'm allergic to cherries. Yeah, um, so I had cherries again today. Yesterday was kind of my first day, I was like, something may be up here, but then today it happened again. So I got some nice cherries over the weekend from Walmart and... I love cherries. I love cherries in the summer. And um, I ate them yesterday and when I did, my mouth started to itch like inside. I was like, oh, that's weird. <sighs> then I had them again today. It happened again. And my lips like feel swollen. They don't really look swollen, but they feel swollen like on the upper inside of my lip. And my throat kind of feels a little swollen. So I'm thinking I may be allergic to cherries, which is a shame. So I'm just drinking some nice water. And um, yeah, I mean, like, I don't feel bad. Um, but it's just, like, weird. I guess, like, I have a minor allergy to it. So isn't that fun? Um, but anyways, I think I'm gonna go get a pink drink now and Bobby is going to be coming over soon and I'm so excited to see her. I love hanging out with her so you guys will see her and we're also filming a another video tonight and it's gonna be so much fun and I'm so excited. So, with that being said, I'm gonna go to Starbucks. <laughs> P.S. Colleen Ballinger is having twins. And I like am so excited to go home and watch that video. I haven't watched her video yet. I saw her like tweet about it, but I'm so excited and like videos like that, I don't like to just, I don't know. I like to just be able to sit down and watch them and like focus on them. And I'm so excited. So I'm gonna go home after I get my pink drink and um, just sit and watch it because I'm literally so excited for her. I have not walked into a Starbucks in a minute. 
back in my car I had such a good experience it was so much fun in there I genuinely cannot remember the last time I walked into a Starbucks I also genuinely can't remember the last time I wore foundation I'm wearing foundation today I don't know my skin was just acting up this morning I was like I'm gonna put on foundation the only foundation I trust rare beauty anyways that is not the point of this clip I just met the best barista she was the sweetest person I have ever met like the best barista I have ever met period that's all I'm gonna say she was so nice she like was like oh my gosh like I love your shirt and then like I was leaving and she's like I just wanted to say like you're so pretty like keep doing you and I was like you're so sweet like I came in here for a pink drink with sweet cream foam and I came in and left with compliments like just like the nicest like I love when people are just so genuinely nice but anyways mmm so good anyways guys I am gonna go home now my foundations looking a little wacky because I had my mask on I've pulled it on and off you know a couple times today I've had it on today so anyways I'm gonna go home and I will catch up with you guys when I'm doing something else I'll probably be with Bobby <laughs> I'm looking dead ass into the wind. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. My IQ went down about four <laughs> points today, so I'm not as intelligent as I usually am. <laughs> <laughs> it was good. On a daily basis, I have the IQ of a goldfish, and today I have the IQ of an igneous rock. So <laughs> I'm in tears. <laughs> I would do anything for this cat. Like, I just, I want everybody to know that. Look at her little face. I love you so much. Good morning, everyone. So, I, I'm gonna let you all gasp. I went to Chick-fil-A this morning instead of Duncan. I know, I'm crazy. Um, but I wanted a hash brown scramble bowl, so I got that. And when I was in the drive-thru, somebody in like the other lane, like I guess hit reverse and they slammed into another car. And um, so I witnessed a car accident this morning. Um, so, you know, just Friday morning things. And I'm also listening to Olivia Rodrigo's new album. And let me just say, Traitor is so beautiful and it hit me right in the heart like even though the situation I related it to is like gone and I'm past it and I'm happy past it um, It's still like when you hear songs that resonate that close to you It just really you know brings all those emotions to the forefront and I love songs like that that like just make you feel and so yeah, um, I love Olivia's album. I cannot wait to listen to the rest of it later and yeah I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna go to work and then I will catch up with you guys after. I just finished listening to Olivia's album. Sour is so good. Like I, I literally when Brutal came on for the first time my jaw was like it just dropped like pop perfection like Oh my god, I have never heard a song like Brutal before. She did not have to snap that hard. Um, my favorites right now. This lighting is so bad, but I wanted to tell you guys like my favorites right now. Brutal, um, Traitor, which is very relatable. Um, One Step Forward, Three Steps Back. She actually sampled New Year's Day by Taylor Swift, like the piano in it. And for some reason, like, it just made me so emotional, like, listening to it. Um, it's a beautiful song. And Enough For You is one of my favorites. Literally, there is not a bad song on this album. Like, 
Miss Olivia Rodrigo has some talent that um, everybody should be afraid of. <laughs> she's 18 and she's so good, you guys. I just, <sighs> my gosh. Anyways, I'm gonna go into Walgreens and see if they have any Squishmallows. And yeah, let's go. None here. <laughs> Hi, baby. My baby. That's really cute. They got some cute stuff yeah, going on yeah. here. Look at that. It's a little barrette. Look. Yeah. And yeah. We're in Target and I'm gonna buy sour and I'm so excited. Oh my god, literally my loves. Best album. Guys, I just walked into a random Walgreens and I found Bop. I don't know if they had these in the back. I don't know if they're bringing them back, but I'm getting one. It's too cute to pass up. Well, I just splurged in a uh, cotton on. Oops. They're playing my girl Taylor. Guys, I just got the cheapest Starbucks order. This was 56 cents because I guess I have to charge for the venti. Honestly, I didn't mind. I just needed some water. I've walked a mile in this mall today. <laughs> in a matter of like maybe 30 minutes. You know, that's my form of cardio shopping. Guys, I just found a friend's vinyl, but it's the 25th anniversary version. Oh my gosh. Limited to 3,000 copies. Why do I feel like I should get it? And they're making the... Oh no, the reunion episodes. I think I have to get it. Like, I... Oh boy, today's my splurge day. Sorry for the weird angle. Like, I'm literally holding my drink. Like, anyways, um, I only had my mask down because I was drinking my water, by the way. Um, and there's nobody around me. Okay, anyways. Um, there's this book for $10. It's on Hollywood fashion. It would just be so cute, like out and I don't know I'm gonna get it my mom has been in this bookstore like since I like started in the mall um since I did like all my shopping she's just been chilling and she's been getting some summer reading so um yeah I think I'm gonna join her and buy something here too oops we are in forever 21 now and this just looks like a Billie Eilish concert hat um, I signed up for pre-sale for her. It's gonna be like impossible to get tickets, but am I gonna try? Yes. Um, I told myself to behave, but I don't... That's so beautiful. Ready. Isn't that the... Look like me? Yes. We are very happy to be out of the mall. We were just over it. Uh -huh. Um, but we got Charlie's Lemonade, which... If you've never had Charlie's Lemonade, I highly suggest it. It's very good. By the way, I had so many people compliment my Olivia shirt, which made me so happy. Like, I don't know, she just deserves so much like love and respect and like, I, it just made me happy that people were like, oh my gosh, I love your shirt. So, we love that. Also, I'm, I did buy a bucket hat in Forever 21 and I was like, it would look so cute with this. So, if you see that on Instagram, you know where to go. This bucket hat, a good purchase. Guys, we're in this really pretty area, and look, we found chickens! Hi, buddy. Hi babies! Oh. This one is like, what? Is that cock fell off? Mom, that's a female! Oh, okay. <laughs> it looks like there's supposed to be one there. <gasps> look at the strawberry! I am. Us being fascinated. I know. Yeah. Aww. So pretty. He only works on weekends though. We are at Rita's now. What are they? I don't know what I'm gonna get. All right, guys. So we got Rita's. What did you get, Mom? Vanilla. I it's got, delicious. yeah, yours looks like root beer, but she got vanilla, and then I got cotton candy, so it's, what, 90? 91. It is sweltering out here. The skink is back in front of my house, 
Oh my gosh, he has like bugs surrounding him. He has like flies flying all around him. He probably gonna have some dinner here shortly then. Yeah, Bobby tried to pick him up the other night. He lives in like this crevice right here. Yeah. He look like he got sunburn. All right, you guys, so it is Saturday night and I'm bored. I'm really bored, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna edit this vlog for fun. Um, but I love you guys so much. Thank you for allowing me to show you my week. I honestly thought I was going to be showing you, you know, more of my schoolwork and stuff, but it was nice because this vlog, like watching it back, I think I'll be reminded, like, when I get my schoolwork done, like, I can just, you know, have fun in the evening, you know, and on the weekend, like, I don't have to think about it, and, you know, I can start fresh Monday, and so I think that's really a nice reminder for me, and, you know, if you're taking a summer class and you're watching this, maybe that would help you as well. I am so excited, you guys, because, like, I don't know, I just feel, I went shopping today, and I splurged a little bit, and I just had a really good day with my mom, and, you know, it was just a really good day, so I'm happy. Anyways, guys, I love you guys so much. I hope this video entertained you in some way, and I sincerely hope I see you, yes you, in the next one. That was the most awkward wave. I apologize. Bye, guys. <laughs>